Mr. President, I declare the 2023 spring commencement of the Florida Agricultural Mechanical University officially open. Let the ceremonies begin.
Good morning. Welcome to the 2023 Spring Commencement Ceremony of Florida Agriculture Mechanical University. We're here to celebrate the educational achievements of this class. This graduating class is joining more than 80,000 alumni across the state, the nation, and the world. Please stand for the Star Spangled Banner sung by Sienna Hayden and Siamara Smith, graduating music industry majors, followed by the meditation by Reverend Judy Mandrell, DCL, co-pastor of Life Changes Church of God in Christ. Amen. Let us pray. Father, we thank you right now for your goodness and your mercy. We thank you for waking us up this morning with the active use of our limbs. And we come to give you praise, glory, and honor for these students here today. God, you have been good to fam you. We have not had one mass shooting, and we thank you. God, we have not had a lot of things to happen that's happened all over these United States. But it's by your goodness and your mercy you have blessed us. You have been good to us, and we thank you. All over this auditorium, God, we got so many reasons to give you praise. We made ways out of no ways. And we understand that if it had not been for you, who was on our side, we don't even know where we would be. God, you brought these students through the waters and through the fires. You made ways out of no ways. You had their families to be blessed. And God, we say thank you. And we ask now, God, that you would just bless them in the name of Jesus. God, we give you glory and we give you praise and we give you honor. 
We pray that there will be a spirit of anointing in this place. We know that we're at the graduation, but God, some have come sick. We pray for healing. Some have come not knowing what's going to happen tomorrow, but God, we thank you because you are God that's made ways out of no ways. You can open doors that man shut. And God, we give you praise and we give you glory. All over this auditorium, we are clapping our hands because we say thank you. We open our mouth and thanks, God, because you've been good to us. And we bless you. We don't even take credit for where we are today. For we know that if you had not stepped in when you stepped in, we don't know where we will be. But since you did step in, we will give you glory. We will give you praise. And we will give you honor. Thank you for blessing these students. Thank you for making ways. Hallelujah. Some cried at night not knowing what's going to happen. But this day, May 6th, you brought them to graduation. And we say thank you. You brought their families here. And we say thank you. You brought grandmamas and mamas and daddy. And God, we say thank you. And as we close this prayer, we thank you for being our shepherd. You're a good, good father. You're a good, good provider. You're a good, good healer. And so we magnify you. And I know we're not in church, but God, all over this auditorium, we open our mouth and we say thank you. We clap our hand and we say thank you. For we understand that God is our God. He's our protector. Thank you for protecting fam you. And we give your name praise, glory, and honor. And we ask you to bless this place. And it's in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. All right, please be seated. Please join me in giving a warm welcome to Trustee Craig Reed, a member of the Florida a University Board of Trustees who will bring greetings. Good morning. I'm so glad I'm from FAMU. Singing glory, hallelujah, I'm from FAMU. On behalf of the Chairman of the Board of Trustees, Kelvin Lawson, my fellow Board of Trustees members, President Robinson, COO Dr. Maurice Edison and Provost Allison Watson, deans of all colleges, the faculty and staff of this great institution, I bring greetings and a warm welcome to all parents, family, friends, and graduates as we celebrate this great day of academic achievement. Today is the culmination of a journey that started many years ago, one with many ups and many downs. But here you are today, ready to walk into your future, educated, battle-tested, and prepared to take on the world as the next generation of leaders of all fields of human endeavor. Parents, family and friends, on behalf of FAMU, I say thank you. Thank you for entrusting in us and giving us this opportunity to serve you. Graduates, congratulations. This is not the end, but the beginning. Your time is now. Welcome to all. Thank you, Trustee Reed. Our speaker of the hour is the Honorable Marcia L. Fudge, J.D., the 18th Secretary of the United States Department of Housing and Urban Development, better known as HUD. Secretary Fudge served as a U.S. Representative from the 11th Congressional District of Ohio from 2008 to 2021. She is a past chair of the Congressional Black Caucus. As a member of Congress, Secretary Fudge earned a reputation of tackling the unique challenges of her district by working with her congressional delegation and across political ideologies. In 1999, Secretary Fudge was elected as the first female and first African-American mayor of Warrensville Heights, Ohio, a position she held for two terms. As a former mayor, Secretary Fudge has, been, has seen firsthand the need for economic development and affordable housing. 
Secretary Fudge believes our housing issues do not fit into a one-size-fits-all approach. She advocates for policies and programs that can adapt to meet a community's unique housing challenges. She is committed to making the dream of home ownership and the security and wealth creation that comes with it a reality for all Americans. Under the Secretary's leadership, HUD is working to eradicate the growing homelessness issue, put an end to discriminatory practices in the housing market, and to ensure that our fair housing rules are doing what they are supposed to do, opening the doors for families who have been systematically locked out for generations to buy homes and have a fair shot of achieving the American dream. Secretary Fudge's career in public service began in the Cuyahoga, I think I got that right, County Prosecutor's Office, where she rose to budget and finance director. She earned her bachelor's degree in business from The Ohio State University and law degree from The Cleveland State University, Cleveland Marshall School of Law. She is past national president of Delta Sigma Theta Sorority Incorporated and a member of his Greater Cleveland Alumni Chapter. Without question, Secretary Fudge has established herself as a scholar, a leader, and a good friend of FAMU. Please join me in giving a warm Rattler welcome to your speaker, the Honorable Marcia L. Fudge, J.D. Thank you so much. Good morning. Good morning. All right. Thank you, Mr. President and uh, Provost Watson and members of the Board of Trustees, the faculty, staff, distinguished guests, and speakers. But before I say a few words to the graduating class of 2023, I want to recognize the people who are the wind beneath your wings. Your parents, your grandparents, your siblings, your spouses, your friends and extended family. It is your sacrifice and love, your prayers, your care packages, and your cash apps that help make today possible. Those prayers might be the only reason a few of our scholars actually graduate today. I thank you for all you have done to help these outstanding students reach this milestone. To the graduates of Florida Agricultural and Mechanical University, class of 2023, congratulations to you. Every exam, every term paper, every long night and early morning brought you to this moment. Whether you are the first in your family to attend college or a third generation rattler, the child of immigrants, a single parent, a student athlete or a working scholar. If you are graduating summa cum laude or just thank you laude, today <laughs> is a tremendous achievement for you and all those who will follow in your footsteps. I commend you for making it this far. You should be very proud of yourselves. I was the first college graduate in my family, which paved the way for all the other now college graduates who followed me. What you will achieve today will pave the way for someone else. I know for many of you, the road that brought you here was not easy. There may be people who started this journey with you who will not finish it with you. There may have been moments when you thought, I don't have what it takes to finish. But I knew you could, your parents, your professors, and your loved ones all knew you could. No matter what challenges came your way, you are graduating because you believed in yourself. You had faith. Faith in yourselves, faith in your future, and a faith that your family, your fam you family, had your back. You have come this far by faith. Soon you will join the ranks of the prestigious graduates of Florida Agricultural and Mechanical University of FAMU. For 136 years, FAMU has produced leaders in every field and every industry. 
politicians and producers, scientists and artists, scholars and executives, people like Congressman Alcee Hastings, my good friend for whom this very building is named, Al Lawson. Thank you for being here today, Mr. Lawson. <laughs> Carrie and Kendrick Meek, Althea Gibson, Dr. Mona Humphreys Bailey, my own staff, Alan Williams is with us today, who is a diehard Rattler. Aniki, Anika Noni Rose, Roy Wood, who was so outstanding at the Correspondents' Dinner last night, I can't say enough about him. And my nephew is here with me today, Cornelius Jones and Richie Jones. Thank you for being here as well. Generations of alumni who embody excellence with caring and shape our culture from the clothes we wear to the news we watch to the technology that gets many of us through a work day. Class of 2023, you are the next generation of leaders who will demand that this country lives up to its promise, to its ideals. You, class of 2023, are the ones we have been waiting for. Your generation will ensure we leave this world better than we found it. For the past four years or so, you have received all the training and preparation you need to make a difference, to do great things. You have traversed the hill to attend classes in Jones Hall and Tucker Hall. You cut up at Set Fridays after a long week of laughs. I know you did, because I saw the, the videos. Y'all might need to clean them up, too. <laughs> you cheered on the Rattlers and the Marching 100 at homecoming. You've given back to your community. You have represented FAMU and the entire HBC, HBCU community at prestigious internships and fellowships. Now you are about to begin the next chapter of your journey. Very soon, you will say goodbye to a place that has been your home at a very pivotal moment in your life, a campus, a safe place, that shielded you from the cruelty and brutality of the world around us. I know the road may look bright to the dreamers among us, but for the realist, it may look bleak. Every day, we are confronted with another tragic reminder of how dark things have gotten. Perhaps I have always seen the cup half full. I have seen so much. I have lived through difficult times before. But even lately, I am worried about the future of our nation. This year alone, we have seen lawmakers barely older than many of you expelled for standing up for what is right. We have seen rights we have all been taught were inalienable, treated like they're disposable. Our safety has been threatened at every turn. All the while, those who have been charged with the important task of leading Strike and strike again. So hold on to the lessons you have learned on these hallowed grounds. Carry the legacies of those who sat where you are sitting right now. Carry them with you as you step out into the world. And always remember that one person can make a difference. You can make change. So as you set forth on your next chapter, I want to just give you a few things to keep in mind. Number one, it costs nothing to be kind. 
in a world full of cruelty and unkindness, be kind. Because what I learned is that people help people they like. Not always the smartest, not always the most attractive, not always the best dressed, but the people they like. So be likable. Every day will not be your best day. Every day you will not wake up going at 100 miles an hour. But every day you must give the best you have that day. Whether it's 45 miles an hour, give the best you have that day. I'm going to ask you to be patient with yourselves. God willing, you will live a long life. This means that you have plenty of time to get everything right. Your life does not need to be perfect right now. So give yourself some grace. Give yourself some time to learn and to grow. Never stop learning. Just because you have a degree from the highest ranked public HBCU does not mean you know everything. I consider myself a lifelong learner, and you should too. If you think you know everything, I encourage you to read, to talk to people, to gain a new understanding, to get a different perspective. You'll be surprised what you might learn. And if you are know-it-all, you will live a very, very lonely life. Now, I can't predict the future, and I will not pretend that I know what will come next for you, but I do know this. Every now and then, things will not go your way. You won't always win. You won't always get the job you want. You will not get accepted into every program. And even if you do, you may find that that program is not the right one for you. And it's OK, because you are resilient. There is nothing more human than failing. And there is nothing more powerful than having the courage to pick yourself up and try again. And my last tip for you is to use your voice. Each and every one of you has the power to change the world. You have the tools you need to make a difference to leave this world better than you found it. You learned so much here at FAMU. So give back to those who come behind you so that they can have a better experience than you had. You have come a mighty long way by faith, and you still have so far to go. Your chapter may be ending, but this is just the beginning of your journey. Nina Simone may say that the class of 2023, that you are young, gifted, and black. You are the voice of change the world needs. You are the hope and the dream of our ancestors. You are the visionaries lighting the path for those who will follow in your footsteps. Class of 2023, you are the ones we have been waiting for. So enjoy today. Celebrate all you have accomplished. Take stock of what this means for you, for your future, and for your loved ones who can't wait, unfortunately, to ignore the dean's calls not to shout when you walk across this stage. <laughs> Take in all of the love, the joy, the excellence that surrounds you. Because come Monday morning, the real work begins. So congratulations, class of 2023. Go and change the world, because you are the ones we have been waiting for. Thank you. Thank you, Secretary Fudge. I would like for you to join me back at the podium, please. Secretary Fudge, if you would. I am honored to present the President's Award to the Honorable Marcia L. Fudge, J.D., for serving as our 2023 Spring Commencement Speaker, presented this sixth day of May, 2023. Thank you. Now, will Makira Barnes please stand? Makira Barnes, please stand. This morning, we would like to recognize Makira Barnes for her commitment and outstanding leadership while serving as Student Government Association Vice President for the 2022-2023 academic year, also serving as a White House Scholar doing her tenure here on the Hill as well. Thank you so much.
Thank you. Please be seated. At this time, I will ask Chastity Nix and Destiny Kendrick to please come forward. This morning, Florida A&M University presents the Bachelor of Social Work degree posthumously to Lakeisha Yvette Nix, accepting the degree in her honor are her daughters, Chastity Nix and Destiny Kendricks. Please join me in giving the family of Lakeisha Nix a round of applause. Every FAMU graduate has at least one reason to give back to the university that has provided them much more than a college degree. FAMU is recognized as a place where students discover their potential, ignite their passions, and meet lifelong friends. But more importantly, FAMU is a place where students develop an appreciation of the importance of giving back. Many of our graduates are adorning beautiful medallions with their regalia this morning. It is the first time that some of them have contributed as alumni donors to Florida A&M University. We applaud their participation and willingness to give back to the institution that has given so much to them. At this time, will all donor participants in the spring 2023 graduating class stand and be recognized? Please show your blink. Thank you. Please be seated. <clears throat> Will all honor graduates please stand and be recognized? All honor graduates. Congratulations. Thank you for demonstrating excellence. Please be seated. Will all graduates finishing in four years or less please stand and be recognized? Thank you. Uh, please be seated. Will all legacy rattlers please stand and be recognized? Thank you. Please be seated. Will all candidates for graduation with AA degree from state colleges or community colleges in Florida, please stand and be recognized. Please be seated. Thank you. Will all candidates for graduation who are also veterans of our armed forces, please stand and be recognized. Thank you for your service and your sacrifice, and congratulations on reaching yet another important milestone in your lives. Please be seated. FAMU has been home, your home, for the past few years, and we are fortunate to have had you here to see you grow into the wonderful citizens you are and will surely continue to be. We know that these experiences and the education that you receive will serve you well as you join our alumni community that is making a difference all over the world. Thank you for choosing Florida a &M University. It is with great pleasure that I introduce our platform guest. Please hold your applause until the end. Once again, I would like to introduce a member of our Florida a &M University Board of Trustees, Mr. Tra Craig Reed. Trustee and Faculty Senate President, 
Anne Marie Cavazos. I get everybody? No more trustees? Oh, and SEA president hiding over there. Uh, and your uh, trustee member as well, Mr. Zachary Bell. Thank you all for joining us today. At this time, I would like to ask all of the FAMU senior administrators and deans who are here on the stage to please stand and be recognized. These are the people who make this place work. Thank you. Please be seated. It is now my pleasure to recognize some distinguished guests who are here with us today. First, before I forget, my wife Sharon Hollowell Robinson of 38 years is with us today. Ms. Tanya Eddington, the wife of our Chief Operating Officer, Dr. Maurice Eddington is here with us this morning as well. Mr. Derek Watson, husband of our interim provost and vice president of academic affairs, Dr. Allison Watson is here with us also. And he's doing dad duty, I'm told, today. And of course, the, the person after whom this building is named, former U.S. Congressman, Mr. Al Lawson, is with us this morning. Of course, we have with us Mr. Alan Williams, Alumnus and Deputy Assistant Secretary of Intergovernmental Affairs. The Department of Housing and Urban Development is with us as well. Thank you for joining us this morning, Mr. Williams. Uh, Mr. Darrell Jones, the Chair of the Leon County School Board is with us. Thank you, Darrell, for joining us this morning as well. And our former Governmental Affairs Director, Tola Thompson, is with us here. Thank you, Tola, for joining us. Okay. And then I see him here to celebrate his graduates again today, Coach Willis Simmons. Thank you, Coach Simmons, for joining us uh, this morning. While all of these persons are deserving of our acknowledgement, I know that each of you graduates can point to one or more faculty members or staff members who have made a difference in your journey here at Florida a &M University. Please join me for a round of well-deserved applause for our faculty members who are sitting to your left and right who have made a difference in your journey here on the Hill. Thank you so much for guiding these young, brilliant minds. Thank you. It is now my pleasure to present Dr. Allison Watson, the Interim Provost and Vice President of Academic Affairs, who will introduce the Armed Forces Commissioning Ceremony, followed by the president's presentation of the de deans and the conferral of degrees. Dr. Watson, thank you. Mr. President, it is my pleasure to present Lieutenant Colonel Christopher E. Everett, U.S. Army Professor of Military Science, who will present the candidates for commissioning. For the 2023 commissionees, post. Raise your right hand and repeat after me. I state your name. Do so solemnly swear. I'll support and defend the Constitution of the United States of America against all enemies, foreign and domestic, that I bear true faith and allegiance to the same, that I take this obligation without mental reservation or purpose of evasion, that I will well faithfully discharge the duties of the office which I'm about to enter. So help me God. 
President Robinson, I'd like to present to you, on behalf of the President of the United States, the 2023 Commissionees. Second Lieutenant, Tiambre Garcia, Active Component, Medical Service. Second Lieutenant, Austin Hall, Reserve Component, Transportation Corps. Second Lieutenant, Asia Ronan Johnson, Reserve Component, Military Intelligence Corps. Second Lieutenant, Tia Terry, Reserve Component, Signal Corps. Second Lieutenant, Meyer Walker, Reserve Component, Military Police Corps. Second Lieutenant, Marissa Wells, Active Duty, Chemical Corps. Second Lieutenant Nathan Bright. Second Lieutenant Bright will be reporting to the basic school in Quantico, Virginia to undergo training as a provisional rifle platoon commander. Second Lieutenant Peyton Gustafson. Second Lieutenant Gustafson will be reporting to the basic school in Quantico, Virginia to undergo training as a provisional rifle platoon commander. Second Lieutenant Zachary Ranchfall. Second Lieutenant Ranchfall will be reporting to the basic school in Quantico, Virginia to undergo training as a provisional rifle platoon commander. Mr. President, I have the honor on behalf of the colleges and schools within the university of presenting the following academic deans who will in turn present their candidates for degrees. The first academic dean is Dr. Valencia Matthews, Dean of the College of Science, Social Sciences, Arts and Humanities. Will all candidates graduating in the College of Social Sciences, Arts and Humanities, please stand. Mike, Mike.
Mr. President, I have the honor on behalf of the faculty of the College of Social Sciences, Arts, and Humanities of presenting these candidates for the following degrees. Bachelor of Arts in English, Bachelor of Arts in Fine Arts, Bachelor of Arts and Bachelor of Science in Political Science, Bachelor of Arts in Theater, Bachelor of Criminal Justice, Bachelor of Science in African American Studies, Bachelor of Science in History, Bachelor of Science in Interdisciplinary Studies, Bachelor of Science in Music and in Music Industry, Bachelor of Science in Philosophy and in Philosophy and Religion, Bachelor of Science in Psychology, Bachelor of Science in Sociology, and Bachelor of Social Work. Thank you. Please be seated. Mr. President, it is now my pleasure to present Andrew Chin, Interim Dean of the School of Architecture and Engineering Technology. <clears throat> Will all candidates graduating in the School of Architecture and Engineering Technology please stand. <clears throat> Mr. President, I have the honor on behalf of the faculty of the School of Architecture and Engineering Technology of presenting these candidates for the degrees of Bachelor of Architecture, Bachelor of Science in Architectural Studies, Bachelor of Science in Construction Engineering Technology, and Bachelor of Science in Electronic Engineering Technology. Thank you. Please be seated. Will all candidates receiving baccalaureate degrees in all colleges and schools please stand? <laughs> Upon the recommendation of the faculty of the colleges and schools of the university, and by virtue of the authority vested in me by the Board of Governors and the Florida A&M University Board of Trustees, I do confer upon you bachelor's degrees as indicated with all the rights and privileges thereunto appertaining to scholars everywhere. Congratulations, and please move your tassels. Thank you. Please be seated. Mr. President, it is now my pleasure to present Dr. Michael Abazinge, Dean of the School of Graduate Studies and Research, who will now present the candidates for the master's degrees. Will all candidates graduating with master's degrees from all colleges and schools within the university please stand? <laughs> Mr. President, I have the honor on behalf of the graduate faculty and the deans of the various colleges and schools of presenting these candidates for master's degrees as shown in the program. Thank you. Upon the recommendation of the graduate faculties of the respective colleges and schools of the university, and by virtue of the authority vested in me by the Board of Governors and the Florida A&M University Board of Trustees, I do confer upon you master's degrees as indicated with all the rights and privileges thereunto appertaining to scholars everywhere. You may now be hooded by each other. Thank you. Please be seated. Will all graduates receiving bachelor's degrees please stand and proceed to the rostrum as directed by the marshals to receive your diplomas.
Congratulations, graduates. The School of Architecture and Engineering Technology, Cornelius Thomas Pace II. Justin D. Grant, magna cum laude. Tayana M. Sykes, magna cum laude. Jaza N. Lowry, cum laude. Reagan Kennedy Green, magna cum laude. Franklin Francisco Cardi Jr., magna cum laude. Olivia Desiree McKelvey, cum laude. Clervin Merrillis, cum laude. Nylas McKinley Hadaway, magna cum laude. Jelena Denise Washington, summa cum laude. Kyla Y. Menard, summa cum laude. Jada Robinson, magna cum laude. Grace Blatch. Preston Antoine Jackson, cum laude. Jordan Presley, cum laude. Keegan Phipps, cum laude. Antonio Rashad Major, summa cum laude. Cameron Janae Brown, summa cum laude. Joshua Francis, summa cum laude. Nupur, Vilma McCurr, Patel, summa cum laude. Devin L. Pryor, magna cum laude. Javel Xavier Strickland, summa cum laude. Priscilla S. Tavares, magna cum laude. Dominique L. Sampson, cum laude. Kevin J. Owen Robinson, magna cum laude. Rachel Danette Drakeford, summa cum laude. Rihanna Alexandria Wilson, magna cum laude. Madison Denise Hunter, summa cum laude. Akil Ranoko Webster, magna cum laude. Adeline Adler Nico B. Brioche. Janae Delana Ferguson, cum laude. Roderick Dwayne Potter, Jr. Marvin Scott, Jr. Malik Khalil Boland. Dewan Brown, the second. Push Hill, Bear Door. Zach Ratchfall. Tyler Jordan Atkins, cum laude. Sean Kareem Marquise Mays, Jr. Akari Derod Boss, cum laude. Congratulations, the College of Social Sciences, Arts, and Humanities. Raisha Renee Rush. Makira Jalisa Burns, student body vice president. Jude Jones, cum laude. Tashana Renee Thomas. Charles Edward Hill III. Asia Johnson. Falom Christian Diodon. Kyangela Aaliyah Smith, magna cum laude. Tamaria Louise Thompson, summa cum laude. Selena Tran. Ashanti Findlay, cum laude. Travis Rodney. Michael Scott Circus. Dylan Riley Horton. 
Brooke, Autumn, Rose, Hudson, Magna Cum Laude. Christine Wallace. Tyja Lynn Davis, Magna Cum Laude. Jamiria, Yvette, Bill Bolt, Summa Cum Laude. Ivory, Ruby, Brooks, Magna Cum Laude. Kayla, Badia, Cum Laude. Christina, Michelle, Martinez, Seno, Summa Cum Laude. Taylor, Underwood. Siana, Monet, Hayden, Summa Cum Laude. Siamria, Aaliyah, Smith. Lacey, Malone, Magna Cum Laude. Rodrigo Gomez. Madison, Brittany, Stewart, Magna Cum Laude. Kimani, Yasir, Comer. Jalen N. Bertrand. Graham Harris, summa cum laude. Taurus Lamont, lovely. Talva Javon, lovely, cum laude. Jayla Ann Nicole Simmons. Aaliyah, Vanessa, Tato, Summa Cum Laude. Emanuela, Pierre. Manice, Dorselli, Cum Laude. Kayla, Glenez, Rawson, Hines. Skyla, Naomi, Hillary, Summa Cum Laude. Janelle Belandi, summa cum laude. Ashanti, Gina, Maria, Smith, magna cum laude. Samantha, Marguerite, St. Louis, summa cum laude. Joseph, Clayton, Martin, the second, summa cum laude. Arnisa, Dion, Baxter, cum laude. Jordan, Clarice, Pola, Cum Laude. Faith, Michelle, Kemp, Magna Cum Laude. Nakayla, Amari, George, Magna Cum Laude. Pache, Rael, Caldwell. Shamara, Green, Summa Cum Laude. Nakia Randolph, cum laude. Alex James Petway. Jennifer Aneka Charles, summa cum laude. Destiny Sharia Price. Destiny Sharia Price. Jordan, Wesley, Still, Magna Cum Laude. Brianna, N. Jones. Brandon, Z. Blair. Brian, Albert, Blair. Nakia, Lene Anabagu, Magna Cum Laude. Jarius D. Pleasant. Kyle Souter, Magna Cum Laude. Xavier Micah Solomon. Nathan Bright. Peyton Michael Gustafson, Cum Laude. Jaden Lee Showers, cum laude. James Allen Irby, the third. 
Jakiah Darnell Harden. Atiana Shade Morrow. Justin Kofi Mensa Mimofa. Faithful Williams. Cum laude. Reginald Edwards. Shamaya Sheree Lee. Cum laude. Queen Serena Thomasine Lewis. Magna Cum laude. Chelsea Brianne Hardnett. Jada Jarrett. Magna Cum laude. Brielle Sierra Levels, magna cum laude. Raven Simone Smith, summa cum laude. Sierra Lakiria Puritas. Asiana Ronan Johnson, cum laude. Marianne M. Harriel. Lois Gideas. Magna Cum Laude. Jamiria Bouvoir. Hunter. James Garcia, magna cum laude. Charlie H. Smith II. Justin Javon Roberts, magna cum laude. Jared A. Beverly, magna cum laude. Mia Nicole Blassengang. Magna Cum Laude. Alana Kyra Dunphy. Anaya Brene Nelson, Magna Cum Laude. Jade Y. Holland, Summa Cum Laude. Zipporah Iman Reeds. Samantha Romain. Nia Desiree Spalding. Leilani Blunt. Sierra Shanae James Cum Laude. Victoria Walker. Chad. McPhee, Jarvis S. Herring, summa cum laude, Jermaine D. Pittman, cum laude, Timothy Lee Taylor, Jr., cum laude, Lavarius Anthony Foreman, summa cum laude, Joseph Terrell Williams. Imani Alexandria Jackson. Sydney Brianna Griggs, summa cum laude. Shemaya Milan Booker. Chad Jamaica Giles. Cassidy Williams. Miles DeAndre Barker. Deja Aless O'Hari. Stephanie A. Warren, summa cum laude. Devon Adrian White, cum laude. Taylor Liana Jackson. Aaliyah. Juana Wilson, summa cum laude. Brenaya Latisse Dixon, summa cum laude. 
Jordan, Darnisha, Fleming, Cum Laude, Autumn, Marie, Rivera, Magna Cum Laude, Darnice, Kishan, Aman, Huntley, Magna Cum Laude, Roots, Messina, Angelia, Angela, Janila, Green, Cum Laude. Cheyenne, Renee, Dunkley, Magna Cum Laude. Kaya, Amari, Noema, Thomas, Cum Laude. Asia, Brianna, Jarman, Cum Laude. Jalen, O'Shawn, Johnson. Keldrick, Vashon, Franklin. Exaria, Lashane, Bullard, Cum Laude. Shaderic, Alasia Cunningham, Summa Cum Laude. Zataria, Michelle, Ray. Troy, Stribling, Jr., Cum Laude. Jacole, Tiana, Joel, Grace. Vinya, Eveline, Dacius. L'Oreal, Rhines. Tamir, Gresham, Summa Cum Laude. Juliana, I Iman, Silvan, Magna Cum Laude. Shamika, M. Gartrell, Magna Cum Laude. Latasha, Yvette, Marshall, Cum Laude. Michelle, Brittany, Mitchell, Cum Laude. Nate, St. Hilaire. Leon, McLean. Isaiah, Tyler, Land. Jelani, Bland. LaJean Howard. Khalid, Elijah, Copeland, Magna Cum Laude. Cameron, Ty, Coven. Kamari, Lee Anthony, Stevens. Avon, Bryant, Magna Cum Laude. Brittany, Chanel, Jackson. Ariane Barnes, summa cum laude. Sylvia Villa Gomez, cum laude. Tyson Leek A. McTavish, magna cum laude. Maya Louise Johnson, summa cum laude. Howard Jacquez Hill. Jalea Nishan. Soba, Cum Laude. Tavian, Tyreek, Green. Kaylin, Brunson, Cum Laude. Insadra, Alicia. De Jesus, Cum Laude. Anastasia, Amati, Anderson, Summa Cum Laude. Mykena, Leon Shea, Johnson, Summa Cum Laude. Dewanda, Deshay, White, Summa Cum Laude. Tiasia, Marie, Gray, Cum Laude. Selena, Marie, Gatry, Cum Laude. Adrian, Dwayne, Wilson, Cum Laude. Naya, Simone, Brigham. Laurentia, Sierra, Palmer, Cum Laude. Laquisha, Jean, Baptiste. Miracle, Addie Lee, Bolden, Cum Laude. 
Sierra, Michelle, Thigpen, Cum Laude. Derika, Shantae, Fitzgerald, Summa Cum Laude. Derika, Shantae, Fitzgerald, Summa Cum Laude. Decarian, Delano, Holman, Magna Cum Laude. Reginald D. Dotson Jr. Cum Laude. Kayla Nicole Way, Magna Cum Laude. Elijah Basley. Jordan Kareem Kennedy. Taifa Kamala Sanders. Precious Denise Johnson, summa cum laude. Alani Guerra. Rodnisha L. Martin. Jada Tone. Cassidy Latrell Whitaker. Alexia. Effie, Pelt, Burks, Davis. Layla, Khadija, Abdullah, Cum Laude. Kiara, Kinsey, Magna Cum Laude. Tamiko, Y, Woodard, Magna Cum Laude. Rochelle, Beerus, Lucas, Summa Cum Laude. Ayana Larkin, summa cum laude. Denise Monet Thomas, magna cum laude. Cassandra Lamage, magna cum laude. Kazayan, Kiara Gibson, magna cum laude. Evelyn Kayleen Lopez. Victoria Funchili, summa cum laude. Michelle Ezion Paul, magna cum laude. Ariel Destiny Burks, cum laude. Patrice Jalen Harris, summa cum laude. Shante Anderson. Ikesia Orena Howard. Jayla M. Allen, Magna Cum Laude. Tadeja Simone Mangala. Jasmine Michelle Harris, Magna Cum Laude. Courtney Janae Black, Magna Cum Laude. Diamond Denise Gibson. India Janae McCary. Micaiah DeAsia Edwards, Magna Cum Laude. Imelda All Adoption, Cum Laude. Carlisha Davina Fetch, Cum Laude. Patrick Andrew Nash Jr. Myla Amor Stryker, Magna Cum Laude. Kendra Marie Foster, Cum Laude. Christina Marie Copeland, Cum Laude. Samia Alexandria Gaines, Summa Cum Laude. Malay Elizabeth Moody. Heaven, Monet, McIver. Isaiah, Jordan, Killings. Latia, Saunders. Jemaya. Brianna, Denson. Thaddeus, Ladorn, Warner, the third. 
Christopher Joseph Britton the second cum laude Naya Adia Gunn cum laude Patrick Jakari Bonner Sydney Lanique Falcon Magna cum laude Michaela Marie Wood Lauren Page Taylor Bridges the second Magna Cum Laude Janae A. Moss Cum Laude Aaliyah Ray White Dorothy L. Sanders Kiana Monet Fowler Summa Cum Laude Nayeli Wheatley Talleyrand, Magna Cum Laude. Jessica Kelly Parisian. Alani G. Pierre. Kayla Chanel Armand. Markeisha Mia Lewis. Jennifer Sable Wilson. Gabrielle Michaela DeBose, cum laude. Cameron Khalil Mackey. Joanne Natalie Diondane, cum laude. Francis Folliwell Okicola Olazai. Janaya Benjamin. Jalen Wilkins, Kayla Grant Dixon, and Deanna Smith. Will graduates receiving master's degrees please stand and proceed to the rostrum as directed by the marshals to receive your diplomas. Congratulations, graduates. The School of Graduate Studies and Research. April Hart. Zakaria Tali. Tali. Mayor Gary Levon Russ Jr. Amber Tribute Williams, Christian C. Brown, Kishara D. Fox, Stephanie Clarissa Dolphin, Kaya Melanie Elias, Terrell Hill. Tarlisha Montgomery. 
Tracy Sannon, Kendally Joseph, Nura Agabani, Abra Amasi, Shaquan Marlin, Virginia. Dario Antonio Smith. Regine Lauren Swanson. Sky Kareem Slayton. Andrea Lynn Butler. Zachary Faza. Jackson Tyler Garber. Kobe Alexander Gibson. Deshaun Joseph Johnson. Tiante Monique Diggs. Peyton Reve Willie. Ethel Chalabu Nedule. August Alderman. Veronica R. Mixon. Kunima Kennedy. Bobby Smith. Alexis Sharice Findley. Alexis Deal. Mercedes S. Ash. Regina Chantre Carter. Shannon Magdalia Vasquez. Chelsea Nikia Cole. Kenija Jamiria Monroe. Gretel, Faye, Hudson. And Nicholas, Jawan, Blutcher. Ladies and gentlemen, we will now have the Senior Transcendent Ceremony. This ceremony will be conducted by Ms. Carmen Cummings-Martin, Associate Vice President of University Engagement and Alumni Affairs. Ms. Carmen Cummings. It's a beautiful day on the highest of seven hills. And while we appreciate the warmth and tradition of the pomp and ceremony that envelops us all in this wonderfully beautiful Lawson Arena, named after the one and only Congressman Al Lawson, I still have to ask our graduates one question. Are there any rattlers in the house this morning? To our esteemed university trustees, our illustrious president, university leadership, First Lady Sharon Robinson, to our esteemed speaker, our distinguished deans, invaluable faculty and staff, and our dedicated commencement committee, and our stellar students and adoring families, and to our alums, FAMU alums, please stand. Yes. And members of the FAMU National Alumni Association. I am Carmen Cummings, a proud graduate 
of the prestigious School of Journalism here on the highest of seven hills. And I am honored to serve as an ambassador of this great institution and to present the Senior Transcendent Ceremony today on behalf of the 19th President of the FAMU National Alumni Association, Mr. Curtis Johnson, who is on travel. Well, the members of the graduating class, you're already energized and standing as you prepare to make the transition from student to alum. We want to impress upon you that for the past several years, you have been a part of the fabric of this institution. You are now about to become a part of its history forever. You are among the privileged who have been nurtured in the spirit of many men and women who have passed this way and are rendering distinguished service to their communities because of the dedication of FAMU to a quality education. You have been trained by men and women who have passed on to you the very best that time and experience have given to them and you need to remember their dedicated service. As a member of the FAMU National Alumni Association, do you solemnly promise to remember that you are the recipient of a great and precious heritage, that you will strive with all your might and energy to prove yourself worthy through service to mankind and to support the programs of Florida A&M? Do you so promise, graduates, your answer is, I do. On behalf of the 19th President of Florida A&M University's National Alumni Association and our 12th University President, we are proud to pronounce that you have full membership in the association for one full year with all rights, privileges, and duties appertaining thereunto. We encourage you to maintain networking with alums in respective communities with which you will call home someday. We also invite you to give back in support of other students who desire to follow in your footsteps. Congratulations, Rattlers. This is your moment. You did it. Now go out into the world, make your mark, and make them speak your names. Thank you, Ms. Cummings. Please be seated. This is indeed a day to celebrate the achievements of our graduates and a day to also remember and thank those who laid the foundation for many of your accomplishments. Your de degree will only include your name, but certainly the efforts made to achieve these milestones were more than your own. Many of you would not be seated here today were it not for that special someone who provided invaluable support in countless ways throughout your journey here on the highest of seven hills. Whether you're from a long line of Rattlers or you are the first in your family to earn a college degree, your parents, grandparents, spouses, partners, other family members and friends who have filled this arena have been the special someones who play significant roles in your success. Graduates, please join me in giving them a round of applause for their support of you on this journey. We like to say that great things happen at Florida A&M University every day, and commencement is clearly one of those great things moments. We are the U.S. News & World Report's highest ranked public HBCU in the nation for the fourth consecutive year. You're ranked 103 among top national public universities as well, but perhaps most importantly, we're ranked 23rd in terms of social mobility, which is an indication that even in 2023, we continue to transform the lives of our students, their families, and their communities. And you will make sure that that continues for years to come. To our newest graduates and alumni, this challenge is for you. Forge ahead. Stay positive, make an impact, and continue striking from the top. Reflect on, remember on your time here and how you have to set a very high bar. As a result of your accomplishments, people are fighting to get into the seats that you are leaving. The number of students applying to this institution is at an all-time high.
You are the beneficiaries of our committed service to our students and to our communities. You are an indication of our culture of excellence with caring. Spring class of 2023, thank you for your perseverance, for pushing forward and never giving up. You're tomorrow's leaders and the world will not be right without you in it. As Lizzo would say, you're special. And in case nobody made you believe it, you are special. We'll always love you the same because you are special. And if that's not good enough, Rattlers, tell them that Larry said the following. When the dark clouds gather on the horizon, when thunder and lightning fill the skies, when fate is but a glint in the eye of a fallen Rattler, and hope's a lost friend, when the sound of the chest grows weary, when those hard-charging linebackers and the muscles in the legs grow tired from those hard-charging running backs, you must always remember that the Rattlers will strike and strike and strike again. Congratulations, class of 2023. Please stand for the alma mater after which Pastor Mandrell will give the benediction. Following the benediction, please be seated for the recessional of the stage party. Congratulations, class of 2023. So God, as we conclude this commencement, we speak favor and blessings upon these graduates. We pray that doors will be open. The Lord bless thee and keep thee. The Lord make his face shine upon thee and be gracious unto thee. 
The Lord lift up his countenance upon thee and give thee peace. Amen. Mr. President, I declare the 2023 spring commencement of the Florida A&M University officially closed.